Let's kick it off with Samsung Active 2. Now, Active 2 comes with LTE connectivity, which means it's independent enough to have a SIM card of its own. The Active 2 comes in two variants, that's the aluminium and the stainless steel. The aluminium is supposed to be lightweight and the stainless steel is supposed to be nice and tough. Though the watch can be used independently with a SIM, it's recommended that you have the Samsung smartphone. Just in case you don't, that's not a problem either. What you need to make sure is that is your Android device Android 5.0 or above or if you have an iPhone, is it iPhone 5 and plus. You also have to make sure that it is iOS 9 that your phone carries. If all of these things are sorted, you can use the Active 2. Now let's go back to the watch and see if this product was worth it. This is the box for the aluminium one. The box looks elegant and compact. The device is lightweight and it comes in different colors. Active black, cloud silver and pink gold. The active black looks quite black. The cloud silver looks cool blue mixed with matte silver. And the pink gold, well you can just call it rose gold. The aluminium version of the watch has a wireless charger, pair of straps, an extra pair of straps, a quick startup guide and of course the watch. The strap of the cool blue sits flat. It's about 44 mm and it weighs about 42 grams. If you take out the strap. It's lightweight but I find it loose for my wrist. Dial is large and the bezel is minimal. This is the home key and the back key. On the back you have a sensor. To charge the Active 2, you need to put it on a magnetic cradle and that's about it. Remember, if you are not tracking your activities all the time, the watch will not die on you. It has a 340mAh battery and it charges pretty quickly. To ask for a full charge tentatively. The big dial is also good, the Tizen OS looks up to date and it has 1.4 inch screen. Circular, super AMOLED, full color display, it also adjusts the light according to the ambience. You can change the bands anyway, you have an extra pair and just in case you want to go for a third party wristbands, that's also allowed. You can remove it from the box and use some of the apps of the Tizen OS. You can pull the watch out of the box and you can just go through the Tizen OS and you will find apps that you can use immediately. You have Spotify, you can use Spotify India, you have a Samsung Health app that shows a detailed report of the quality of your sleep. If you're a light sleeper, you're a deep sleeper, what is your REM cycle? This watch tells you all. Plus, you have a heart rate tracker. The Active 2 can also track the way you work out. You can run, you can swim, you can row, you can use the elliptical. Remember, you can use this when you're swimming in a pool. Don't take it for your beach vacations where you plan to jump into the sea. Not for that. It will also recommend some breathing exercises for you just in case you are stressed out. The watch can also help you take calls, receive calls independently. You can have a separate SIM for all your nefarious activities for this watch. Yes, 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 you can use the watch independently. But remember, if you sync it with your smartphone, all your health records, data, etc. are much better organized. So, Samsung Active 2, are we going to buy it?